Salmon Mill here, and welcome to another video. Today I am going to be oh my own. Uh, I'm here. No, I'm not. <laughs> I am going to be building a book statue. See if it hasn't even started. Come on. Hmm. Right. No, that's what I don't. So to build this, I'm going to need some black stain clay, some brown stain clay, some um, some hardened clay and some white wool um light grey wool and so what am I doing? Some brown wool. So, uh, yeah, let's get started. So, I'm going to be building it. right here. So, you're going to want to do three on the bottom, three, blo three, three blocks of black stained clay on the bottom. Then, you're going to want to do an up left diagonal, and then you're going to want to do four more up left diagonals. So, one, two, three. Four. Then on top of this block here, you're going to want to do four. No, wait, what? Yeah, four. I was right. One, two, three, four. Then you're going to want to do one beside it. Hang on, let me make this rain disappear. On the count of three, one, two, three, and we're back. Like I said, the rain would go away. So, <laughs> beside this block here, you're going to want to do, um, with your brown stained clay, you're going to want to do an upright diagonal and go beside it by one. Then do another upright diagonal and go beside it by one. Then you're going to want to do another upright diagonal and go beside it by one. Then, you're going to want to do an upright diagonal of that one Go along beside it by two. Then you're going to want to do four bottom right diagonals. So one, two, three, and four. Then you're going to want to take out your black stain clay and do another bottom right diagonal. Then with your light grey wool, oh wait, sorry, my mistake. Once again, you're going to need some dark grey wool. Underneath that, you're going to want to do two dark grey wool. Then take out your black stain clay again, and you're going to want to do go down by two, then left by one, then a bottom left diagonal, bottom left diagonal, and go beside it by one. Do another bottom left diagonal, and go beside it by one, and then do another bottom left diagonal, and go beside it by one, and it should join up. Yes, it has. Lovely. Right, so you're going to want to take out your hardened stain, your hardened clay, and place a block. Place one here, 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 and here. Then you're going to want to go on top of it until you reach that block there. Then go down a block from it and do a block. Do a bottom right diagonal. Bottom right diagonal and one final bottom right diagonal. Then beside it, you're going to want to take out your brown stain clay and do two beside it. Then do an upright diagonal and go beside it by one. Another, up, well, the easiest way to do it probably would be here and then just like do it from there, sort of thing. As you sort of split it like that. <sighs> Help right now for the hard of it. <clears throat> so you want to take out your white wool and place one here, 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 and here. And you might want to do some dark grey wool here, 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 and here. Hmm. 
Hang on, I seem to have done something a bit evil. Oh, I know what I've done wrong. Mm. That's why it's not working. Oops. Mm. Um, you take out your brown stain clay, and you're going to want to do two there, two here, two here, two here, and then one here. Right, that makes a lot more sense. Are you going to want to take out your grey wool and do two grey wool here, a grey wool here, and then one here and here? Oh, that makes more sense. It's and then one here, then one here and here and here. You're also going to want to do your light grey wool here, here, here and here. Then you're going to want to put your white wool in here and everywhere else in this wee section. So don't go into here just yet. Like I'm just working my way through. Like so. Right, so for this bigger bitty, the easiest way to do it is to take out your brown stain clay and do a bottom right diagonal from this one right here. Now under this bottom right diagonal you're going to want to do a three row of three coming through right so one two three you're then going to want to go underneath this middle one of that three and place a block then go right of it by two then from this center block here you're going to want to come up to this block side so we'll take a long roughly just a bit and then from there. Flips it. Right, that was not meant to happen. I just did that roughly. And like that. <laughs> okay, so you basically want to take it up from here. One, two, three, four up. And then like, like three, and that would be the fourth one up, and then do an up right diagonal. That's that. I've left, left diagonal. That. That's spooky. That's seriously spooky. Then you're going to want to fill in the rest with your brown wool. Not there. Here. Sorry, not there either. Here. And there we go. Does that look like a book? Okay, sorry. Re change. You see what you did the black uh, the brown stain clay replace it with black stain clay because it, it sort of makes it stand out more. There we go. And there's a book. Now I've got two things to set up. So one, um, PlayStation now has more blocks and stuff. And two, I am not from Edinburgh or anywhere else you may think I'm from. It's my uh, it's my tablet recording. So, oh yeah, over here you may be seeing a fish. Mm, doesn't look too good, maybe. But, yeah, there's a lot of random stuff in this world as well. And, um, yeah. I've also been in another world building. I built two giant emoji statues with my brother and I did record a video with him, but it was completely point blank. We just messed about. So, I deleted that, but, yeah, there's the book. So, thanks for watching. This has actually taken quite a while. And I shall see you bunch in the next video. Oh wait, other thing is, please hit the like button. Please, and please do subscribe because it makes me feel all the better. But anyway, thank you for watching this video and I shall see you in the next video. Goodbye.